Exclamation, everybody, and welcome to Battle Station Harbinger. This is a mobile game. Uh, it's actually a game in a series of mobile games uh, around the Battle Station theme. Uh, the first one I actually had on here already that I had I'd found a long time ago was called Battle Station First Contact, I believe. And it was a um, tower defense game, uh, which is why I never really recorded because I don't I'm not that into tower defense games. Um, but it, uh, it revolved around a space station and you had to defend it from incoming waves. It was free to play game, but then you could buy additional chapters and all that stuff. This one here is a premium game. This one you have to actually pay for to get. Uh, I think it was something like four bucks on the app store. But this one is not tower defense. This is a roguelike uh, sort of in this style of well, not even really. I guess it's kind of like an FTL, but you don't see the inside of your ships. It's I'll I'll jump into it and we'll see what it, we'll see. It's better if I can show you what, what's going on here. But this is all by a company called Bug Bite. Uh, been around for a little bit, and as you can see, I've been playing a bit a bit here. I've already played uh, through the training. I played a couple missions or a couple times through on easy, and um, still trying to get the the hang of it myself. But as you can see here uh, on the right hand side, I think if I can move it around a little bit, is the map. And the map is, as far as I know, randomly generated. Uh, so the start point is the is the white button there and the exit is the end. The goal is to get all the way to the exit. Along the way, you get missions and various other things happening. Mostly a lot of enemies to fight. Uh, and this is the ship that I'm starting out with, the BSE Nightingale. I haven't unlocked anything else yet because I haven't played enough. Uh, I assume that you do get levels in the game, and I assume those levels, um, you know, XP level, uh, is what unlocks these other things. I don't know. I'm still level one, even though I've played a couple games here. So we'll see. We'll see what, the, what that's all about. And uh, what do we got? All right. <laughs> Sorry about that. I have no idea what that was. Anyway, uh, let's... I think this is to randomly generate a new one. Yeah, okay. So we can randomly generate a couple different ones here if we want. Keep re-rolling. So on and so forth. Uh, this one is just telling me what, what ship I'm going to use for it. All right. Let's, uh, let's continue on here and get into the game. This will ignore shields. Humans are facing perilous times. Their sectors have been invaded by enemy forces. A new rookie commander is debriefed for the first time. He is our last, best hope for victory. Commander, times are tough. We are facing increasing enemy forces. You are inexperienced, but I have faith in you. I have a secret mission for you. Go to the last sector and wipe out the resistance in this area. Godspeed, Commander. All right, and that is our primary objective, is get all the way, clear the, clear the sector of enemies all the way, all along the way here. So I will accept that mission. And as we start out here, you see there's a lot of a lot of debris around us, and we suck that all in. So when you've, when you've cleared a sector, uh, you end up, you don't have to go fly around and collect all this, all this stuff. It'll actually collect it all for you. Um, playing the tutorial, though, it doesn't give you an idea it gives you an idea of how to play the game but it doesn't tell you everything so for instance this little uh, nine up here that I, I tried to click on but doesn't it's not clickable um, that is upgrade parts so if I look under here and well I don't have anything yet so we'll have to there's a little like nut icon next to it the 1540 there that is how many spare parts we have so I want to put a energy cannon on this guy or something similar to that, maybe a projectile cannon. And then the nine there uh, is your upgrades here, which it doesn't really tell you as far as I know in, uh, in the tutorial. But I can click on one of these and I can upgrade them if I want to. Uh, right now I just want to buy the item. And then I might as well upgrade it while I'm here. So what do we got? We got burst upgrade, uh, recharge time upgrade, Hull damage upgrade. Let's do the hull damage upgrade. So I have some upgrade points. I might as well. Um, and that's this. So this is our main ship. This is what I've got here. 
It's important that you remember to actually put some weapons on it because you start out with nothing. <laughs> Pretty much nothing. The red areas are like turrets and the blue areas, the diamonds are like modules that you can put on that help with, well, they're kind of modules, but they're kind of fixed emplacements um, for various other things. And then there's a, the circle up front is for fighters. So you can get like repair drones and all that stuff. Uh, we don't have enough scrap for that right now. What I do want to do, Oh, and if you're asking me what all these symbols are on the left-hand side, the boxes there, I have no idea. I know if I drag something into the red, it's going to it's going to toss it out. Uh, I don't know what the green does, so I, I I don't know if that's just storage, cargo storage. I don't. I, it's never really explained. Um, if I look at the red button here, you can see I've got wing formations that we can do. So like I can maneuver my guy around here as to what kind of formation he should take on and all that stuff. I would like to move him down there a bit. And what I'd like to do is get myself a fighter here. So we'll get on uh, that section there. And we'll go, we'll get this scout ship since I can afford it. It's 975, it's going to take most of my parts. Uh, so we'll buy that. And then hopefully I have enough. And this ship is joining the party now. Hopefully I have enough to actually give him a weapon, otherwise he's not going to be very useful to me right now. So, no I don't. I don't have enough to give him a weapon. Uh, that's unfortunate. Alright, well, we'll have to defend him for a little bit uh, until we get to uh, get some more parts, more spare parts to use. Alright, so without further ado, this is about all we can do here. Uh, you can click around and my guys will move there if I double click, or double tap I should say. They'll move there very slowly. You don't directly control your stuff necessarily. Um, they'll automatically fire as enemies are there. You just kind of have to maneuver them around and get them into position whenever you can. So we will hit the sector map here. And let's see, where do we want to go? Um, we've got this section down here, which has got three fighters. It's got a fighter wing on it. That one's got a fighter wing. This one has slightly more uh, stuff. The same with that one. But I think, let me see, which way do we want to go? Uh, can I zoom out? Nope, nope, I can't. Um, that's the exit up there. We take the long way around, which might be better because I can probably get some more scrap out of it. So let's go down here and we'll say warp to it. And we'll have my guy take out the enemies, which are relatively easy enemies, which is good. Very, very good. Target that guy, please, and then target this guy now. So I can tell him who to target, and I can tell him where to move, but can't do much more than that. There we go, and all the spare parts are getting sucked into me. Now, I can use some of the spare parts for repairs, but what I would like to do is, now that we're out of combat, I can go in here and possibly give him stuff, but we didn't get a whole lot of... We didn't get nearly enough parts out of that. <laughs> out, of those, out of those guys. So that's not going to do, do me any good right now. So we're pretty much just going to keep on moving then. You can see we're moved down here now. And where do we have this? This is... Possibly... I don't know. I don't know why some of them are yellow and some of them are red. I... Like I said, it doesn't really explain some of these things. I think this is telling me that there's a... Because there's a blue icon here, so I guess that means there's a... A, um... Space station here, maybe? I'm not entirely sure, because that other icon is like a space station. So maybe it's just... There's... A friendly... Ship here? I... Whatever. Let's just go down here and, uh... See what's... See what's going on. Oh, here we go. We've got some more missions. Be given a mission, complete the given objectives to receive a reward. Escort ship. Oh, this is a ship that I have to escort. Escort it to the sector right next to me. So that's pretty simple, it sounds like. Or just clear... S oh, well, actually. This is a an additional mission on top of... Yeah, this is an additional mission on top of my other mission, which is clear sector of enemies. Okay. That's fine. It doesn't tell me. Is it really just the next one? It looks like it's. Looks like it is. All right, we'll take it. We shall take it. 
Uh, let's move around a little bit. Yeah, there's the guy we got to escort. And let's take this guy out. If we can. Alright, they're, they're hurting that guy pretty good. Let's take that guy out since he's being a pain. Yeah, we're not doing a very good escort job here. Not a very good escort job at all. Can I tell this guy to move somewhere? Yeah, colony ship move this way. Oh, well, that's... <laughs> we didn't have a chance there at all. There was no chance to do anything with that. He was pretty much a goner. Alright, so we failed that mission, unfortunately, so we don't get we don't get any of the any of the shinies for that. Uh but yeah, we still don't have enough stuff for an upgrade either. Um what I can do though is let's go in here and upgrade this guy a little bit more. Uh let's do Oh, that's ten. Oh, the next upgrade is ten, okay. Yeah, all your upgrades go up up one or up a tier whenever you do an upgrade, so yeah, that sucks. Okay. Well, we did what we could there. And it looks like there's a space station over here, which would be very nice. Let's go here and see if we can defend this space station, maybe. Maybe we'll have better luck. <laughs> better luck defending this. Who knows? Stranger things have happened. Fortunately, is it? Yeah, the station should be firing, right? It looks like it. Okay, yeah. This is relatively, relatively straightforward here when you've got a space station to help you out. Come on. Come on. Destroy all those things. There you go. And sector's cleared. Excellent. Excellent. Alright. So, given all that... Looks like the station just repaired itself. I wonder, I wonder if the station will repair me. What does this say? Uh, battle station. What is this stuff? Upgrades. Wanderer repair beam. Re-energizer. Plasma cannon. Um, can I like take these? myself <laughs> no I can't okay this is this is stuff to purchase I got it so I gotta purchase it for 1300 or 20 yeah okay all right so that's just purchasing stuff got it uh we have we still don't have a do we have enough we might have enough now wait a minute yes 400 let's give this guy an energy cannon so he's useful to me do that and we will upgrade it um, with accuracy. There we go. Oh yeah, he is repairing me. Excellent. I was hoping he would repair me. That's good. All right, let me get my other guy up there then. Uh, repair ship at station, yes. Let him get all repaired up so that we're good to go. Maybe? Did he repair? I guess he repaired because he doesn't have the repair icon anymore. Alright. It's time to leave this place now. That's good. It's a good good place to find. And what do we got? We've got three more sectors here. I guess we could just take this one. What's, what's what? One, two, three, four, five, six in there. Six in there. Looks like they're all pretty much six, 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 and six. Alright, um, what do I have here? This is my active missions. Okay. Alright, let's move on. Let's move on to this sector. Now, one thing I've noticed about this game, and this is what happened to me. I've been given a mission, complete the mission, to objective, destroy enemy ship. Ooh, okay. Oh, and that's down, down below there. Alright, that's fine. We'll try it. Why not? But the, the thing I, uh, I ran into in the last, um my last playthrough is that you tend to get to a point here where you don't you haven't upgraded enough to continue on like the enemies are just you can see it on the on the map there the enemies are just just too numerous and you know you can't take them on 
but in order to, you know, do anything about it, you gotta kind of drop back to all the nodes you've already visited and, and get back there and try to find uh, lesser things. And I found that that's just like kind of boring, <laughs> honestly, to have to drop all the way back because it just takes a while to do it. And so you end up in a situation where you just kind of just, you're like, you know what, screw it. I'm just going to throw myself at them, even though I know I'm probably not going to win. Um, it's kind of unfortunate, but that's that just seems to be the case here where it's just like you get to a point where it's like, yeah, you know what, whatever. We'll just we'll just do another run uh, that's a little less uh, unlucky. Uh, let's go here. Let's get a accuracy upgrade on that. Very good. All right, so we have a mission to take this guy out. Yeah, got a big puppy down there. I don't think we can take him on right now, honestly. Uh, let's come. I could go up there, and we could take the. See, these are all small ships, and then there's just one large ship there. Um, which, uh, I have a feeling this is not going to go well, but let's try it. Why not? <laughs> Worst case scenario is we die and we have to start all over again. Uh, with a new with a new map, so. Oh, he doesn't have he. Okay, we knocked his shields down already, so that's good. Very good, very good. Just knock those shields down. Oh, my my fighter ship's going to be destroyed. That's unfortunate. Alright, fire. Fire on him, please. Oh yeah, oh yeah, we're getting we're getting ruined here. Completely ruined. <laughs> like I said, it's you know, at that point I could have dropped all the way back and did other things, but you know you feel like it just feels like you should just throw yourself at it and, and start and try again. <laughs> um, because it is very, very random as as everything goes here. You can see I've got I'm only like almost halfway through level one and I, I played several games here so let's try again let's do it, get a, a new map going and see if we can do a little bit better this time maybe <laughs> all right and clear sector of enemies got it let's get all this scrap up in up in us and let's see what I can do with this. We've got, so we got 1,768 scrap that time, which might be enough to do what I was trying to do before. So we'll get this 450 going here. We'll take that. Um, and then I want to come over and get a, I want to get a fighter ship. So we'll go here, we'll buy the ship. And Still, I have slightly more scrap than I had before, but not enough to give him a weapon yet, but should be able to get to it relatively, relatively quickly. So we'll do that and hull damage upgrade on this guy. And then let's move on to the first node here. Only got two guys to go after, not a big deal. There we go. And I'll take these guys out relatively simply. Now, give me enough scrap for... Nope. <laughs> nope, not enough. Wouldn't give me enough scrap for at least 400 there. I need 20 more to do what we need to do. So let's move on from here and down to here. We'll go after these guys. A little wing of fighters down there. guy out. Alright. Seems like I can try to suggest it destroy something, but sometimes it <laughs> sometimes it's like, no, I'm I'm in, I'm busy doing something else here. Alright, now we have enough. So come over here, we'll give this guy a energy cannon. Like so. Can I do an upgrade? I need eight to do an upgrade. Okay. Alright, fine. That's alright. We'll just move along with what we've got. And down here. 
And there's another big ship down here. This is <laughs> sometimes you some. I guess this is this is the one of those times, right, where it's like the way the map is laid out. I pretty much have no other choice but to go forward, even though honestly, this is not going to go well because there's already a big ship here. Although I guess I could wait and see if they. Yeah, no, they didn't move. So you can wait a turn to see if they move away, but they are not. Let's see if he's. Yeah, no, they're just kind of hanging around there. They're not. <laughs> they're not. They're not moving from that spot. All right. Well, let's just do it and see what see what comes out of it. I don't know what all these buttons do. <laughs> I honestly don't. I'm tapping them. I don't know what they do. Are they just target these things? Uh, I think that's target these things. That's probably what it is. What to target. Oh, there goes my fighter again. This guy is almost done for if I can get over there. Nah, this is not going to work. This is not going to work. Not going to work at all. Not with all these these missiles coming at me. Nope. <laughs> Alright, so like I said, it never explained what the targeting system was. Like the subsystem targeting or anything like that. Um, so I'm trying to figure this out as we go. <laughs> Let's see if we can get a better starting node. Yeah, that's a little bit better starting node there. Alright. Go try it one more time here and see if I can get any any further along than what I did. It's not to, uh, you know, if you, if you like a challenge, it's certainly a challenge. It is certainly a roguelike in that in that regard, where it's uh, it's kind of a roll of dice to see what you get. Now, like, see, now I got two thousand scrap this time, which is a whole lot to work with, right? So I can go and do pretty much everything I was going to do before with this. And then over here, we'll, we'll move this guy up a little bit, like so. Maybe, maybe I'll put him up front, front and center. That might be good. We'll go like this, buy that ship. Come back here. Uh, he will join my party. And then I'll go over here and give him a weapon. I'll uh, we'll give him a energy cannon. Excellent. We will upgrade his energy cannon. Let's do recharge time, burst upgrade. Um, let's do accuracy. Let's yeah. Let's do do the accuracy one again. Why not? All right, now that we've done that, we can come over here and let's see what is in store for us. We got three there, three there. Yeah, it's pretty much standard stuff. Right, we'll come down here and take on these guys. Oh, very nice. So we know we can get through through these relatively easily. <laughs> is nice. There we go. And then that guy should be taken care of soonish. Soonish. Nice. Excellent. All right. All righty, all righty. Um, 321. That's not enough for me to get another Thing, but that's okay. Let's grab this guy and we'll just tell him to repair himself for 66. Alright. Actually, this guy, can I, do I have enough for an upgrade here? Yes, I do. Hull damage. Let's do that. So we got one that should do pretty well with shields, the little fighter, and one that should do pretty well with the hull, hopefully. Uh, let's come over to this other node. So we don't go too far ahead of ourselves and try to try to level ourselves up a bit, quote unquote, level level ourselves up. 
And... Almost here. There we go. Sick the clear. Get all that scrap in me and upgrade stuff. And we didn't take any damage that time. That's good. We're getting better. <laughs> Slightly better. Uh, which way? Which way do we want to go now? There's a lot of guys on it. This one has all small guys, so I think we can take on... I think we can take on all the small guys. It's when we get to the larger ships that we gotta be a little bit more cautious. Slightly, ever so slightly more cautious, given that they we've, we've been wrecked by them several times now. One thing I've noticed, though, it, it doesn't really... You have to double tap to get them, get your guys to move a certain way, and then they sort of kind of doesn't work quite that well. It's sometimes your order is accepted, sometimes it isn't. It's kind of a little bit funky there. Uh, but we have 475. I want to give this guy an energy cannon so that we can. So he's he's a little bit better all around here. And I think uh, I think the next upgrade is going to be more than nine for him. But let's uh, repair him for 16 and repair this guy for 59. All right, so that took all of our all of our scrap that we had, but that's fine. What else do we have in front of us now? Uh, this one, yeah, I think we can take on that many probably. So let's do that. Yes, very good. Excellent. Excellent. Take them all out. We can here. What is that? I've never seen that before. Is that like like super scrap? Is that what that is? We can we can take onto ourselves. That guy should be done for soon. Excellent. Yeah, what is this? What is this glowing thing here? Oh. Oh, you break it up and get scrap out of it. Oh, okay. Huh, interesting. What is that? Why can't I pick it up? Do I not have the room for it? Cargo room? No idea. Uh, let me look at my... Oh, I see. I have to do it in here. I have to drag it out. So what is this? Celestial Dual Plasma Cannon. Um, which is actually rather awesome. So, hmm. So if I take this guy and put him over in, in there, I can take this guy and put him over here. Hmm. Hmm, I say that. Okay. I like it. I like it. So then with that, I can probably come over to my fighter. Or not. Um... How do I transfer things from one ship to another? I guess I gotta drop this here. And then... Yeah, and then this guy can pick it up. She's already got that. I don't know why I did that. <laughs> I honestly don't know why I did that. I'm looking at it like... Yeah, that's the same weapon he's got. <laughs> okay, fine. Fine, fine, fine. Um, yeah, I think we're good there. Good with all that. Let's repair this guy. He's hurting a bit. All right, that's first first time I've encountered anything like that. So, making progress finally. It's it's, I think maybe the randomness is a little bit too random. If I were to if I were to have one criticism here, it's that you know, I feel like there's a whole big portion of the game that I just haven't seen because the the RNG is not giving me decent things. Uh, that guy's, that is a big ship down there. I don't know if I want to take him on yet. But we can come back up here. And auto travel. There we go. And... Oh, there's a, there's a big hostile ship here now, too. Well, <laughs> 
Well, that's that's a thing. Oops. Um, I I thought I was doing. I thought I was being like sneaky, sneaky smart, and all that stuff. But nope, nope, nope at all to that. I was not. My fighter is gonna be gone soon. There. Oh, oh, he did. He did some damage. Excellent. All right, you you guy, you need to. You need to. No, 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 no. You, you, you need to go up here, please, and get out of the fight for a little bit. So I don't lose you very much. Oh, there's there's two no, bigger ships here, but these these look like freighters or something. And you come over here. Just take on take his weapons out. Oh man, we might have we might have done something here for a change. Almost like I was good at this game. <laughs> you could be <laughs> you could be mistaken to think that I'm actually good at this. Okay. Alright, very good. Very, very good. And we got some more stuff up here. Uh come on. There we go. Excellent. And you Oops, can I click on you? Will you let me click on you? There you go. Uh, you prepare, come up here, and let's see if we can grab these things on the edge of the, on the edge of the map here. What does it say? Uh, what is this? Wanderer Distress Beacon. Activate the Distress, distress Beacon in Star Map. This will alert nearby ships of the same race to your sector. Okay. That in there, and then Wanderer Flat Cannon. Hmm. Okay. Forty-five hull damage, shield damage, recharge time. Let's leave that. Let's grab that in the Viper here. What? What is this one? Shield damage is sixty. Hull damage is ten. This is hull damage of twenty-seven. Shield damage of nineteen. What's? Well, that's, that's a whole lot of nothing, isn't it? <laughs> That's kind of a letdown, actually. The thing I bought is a lot better than the thing I just salvaged. Meh. Alright, well, maybe we can sell these off and get scrap for them, maybe? Question mark? I don't know. <laughs> maybe that's a thing. We'll see. Alright, and... Actually, do we have anything... Speaking of purchasing things... Let's see here. I would like some... Repair drones. That would be nice. Uh, fix friendly ships. Yes. And then I would like to upgrade you. Max ships upgrade. Repair upgrade. Now let's do that. Repair upgrade. And then let's come over here. And what is the hull damage? Okay, so shield damage upgrade. Hull damage upgrade. First upgrade, accuracy upgrade. I think well, the accuracy is pretty good. Well, let's do the hull damage upgrade. Get more hull damage out of it. And I think we're good there. Is there anything I can do on this guy? As far as upgrades go? No, that takes 14. Okay. All right. Yeah, hey, we're actually, <laughs> we're actually making progress for a change. I thought this was going to be a, a, a huge bust. Just a huge, huge bust, but no, it's not. And these these guys are a little pushover things, so I think we'll be I think we'll be good here going into this sector. Maybe. Yeah, there we go. Oh yeah, we're we're just owning stuff now. Excellent. This is what I want. This is what I want to see. <laughs> some success for a change. Who who knew? Who knew we could have some success for a change? There's my little repair drones flying around. That's pretty cool. Although they are getting shot at, which is not so cool. All right. Got all of that there. He's getting repaired and then they're repairing him. Does that take uh, spare parts to repair him or did they just do it? I don't know. I don't know. I feel like 160 is what I actually had, um, but We've done that. Let's go on to move on to the next area. So what is over here? More of the same. More of the same. 
Okay. So we can, uh, we can go that way, or we can try to see if there's a, a big honking ship here that needs to be demolished. Let's go down this way. So that takes us further down towards kind of where we want to go. Destroy enemy ship. You've been given a mission. Okay. All right. Accept that mission. Take these guys out. And just move, move along forward here and see what fleshes out of these of this battle. Yeah, sector's cleared. Oh, we got another one of these. Excellent. I'll take it. And what is that over there? Another. That's just another Gatling. Hmm. Well, I'll take it. Why not? Maybe we can sell these things off. I, I assume I can sell these things off at some point. Um, what do we got here? We got this guy. Pair upgrade. Max ships upgrade. Uh, I really want to upgrade this guy a little bit more if I can. Range recharge time. Um... Charge time, range upgrade. Hmm. Hmm. Um, the accuracy goes down with range, which makes sense. Um, maybe, maybe the burst upgrade. Just try that and see what happens. Um, and that is all we're going to do there. Okay, where was that quest at that it gave me? Uh, where? Okay, down there, I guess. It's where it wants me to go for the quest. And what do we have here? It's a bunch of... Okay, this is going to be an escort mission. Alright, fine. Let's see if we can actually rescue this guy. <laughs> see if we can rescue this guy before he's actually destroyed. We'll do that. See what I can do here. Come over and try to try to protect them as much as we can. Do, 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 do. My my repair droids are repairing them. That's that's good. Happy to see that. It looks like these guys have flown away is bad on them because it makes it easier for me to protect this guy. Although they are kind of hitting me from, from a distance. Oh, there's a there's a big ship here. I didn't see the big ship on the on the radar. So he must have just jumped in at some point. Alright, good. Good, good this guy on. Alright, up here we go. He's, we're <laughs> he's, he's, he's flying pretty fast here. and We're very slow by comparison. Come on. Come on. Turn around. Turn around. You can do it. You can do it. He's getting his shields back up again. He's got almost no hull left. It's just it's going so fast we can't can't keep up. My guys can't keep up. All right, any day now. This <laughs> jeez Louise. There we go. There we go. Now he turned around. Excellent. Excellent. Alright, give me all that scrap. We need it. We much need it. Let my let me guy my guys get all healed up here. As well. 
quite a bit of damage with, with that. And... Excellent. All right. Yeah, it does take a little bit of scrap when they start repairing something. Okay. That's good to know. Good to know. Uh, I think we've got everything from this sector. So let's see if we can... Where does this guy have to be escorted to? That is the question. Uh, down there, probably? Let me see. What does it say for missions? Where's the escort mission to? Oh, he's over to there. We have to escort him. All right. Well, got a couple jumps to do that. Who's this guy? Oh, there's two. There's two enemies here. That's that's not gonna go well. <laughs> not with not with us escorting somebody. And there's looks like there's two in this sector as well. I wonder if I wait a turn if the if they'll move out. Oh, they're they're heading for me now. Okay, that's interesting. Yeah, it looks like they're heading towards me. So, let's see. Since they're alone now, let's see what happens. Now that they're alone, it's just, just these two big ships. Because if I can just take them on without taking on the fighters, that might help a bit. In terms of survivability. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Take those broadsides. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Man, that guy's done for. Where's my, my fighter ship at? Oh, he's down there. Okay. He's following me. I'm wondering. Sweet! Sector cleared. So, okay, that's a valid strategy, have them just come to you. That, that works. Alright, um... And with that, this other sector should be just... Yeah, this is just piddly guys. Alright, cool. Let's go there. Clean that up. Because we're escorting somebody. And make sure we take these things out. Oh, yeah. Nope, come on over here. We're going after... We're going after the escorts. Don't be going after my escorts. So, like with mobile, with a lot of mobile games, it's a, it's a whole lot of kind of, it's a very slow gameplay. Oh, there is a, there's a big guy here. There's a big dude down here. It's a lot of slow, the gameplay is relatively slow. Um, and you just kind of have to sort of wait, wait and let your things come in here. This guy is just moving in the completely wrong direction. Like, do not move down in front of us. Let us catch up, please. Thank you. Alright. Keep on moving down here. Towards this other guy and... Make him pay for all the trouble he has caused. Those things still... They are still making their way over there, aren't they? That freaking bastard. That freaking bastard. <laughs> oh no! My fighter... My fighter ship was destroyed. Ah, oh, That sucks. What the hell, man? <laughs> what the hell, repair droids? What are you doing over here? I guess that's my biggest complaint too, is that there's there's things about the game that the game just doesn't tell you about, right? It's like, just figure these out, and it's like, well, they're not very, it's not very intuitive trying to figure, figure these things out, right? Like, hey, is there a way to tell my repair droids to like, stick with, to stick with the one guy? You know, is that possible? Is it not possible? Can never tell. <laughs> Can never tell. Maybe it's possible, I don't know. Um, I would still like a fighter ship, but we're, we don't have enough. It takes 900 scrap for that. We don't have enough for that. Instead, I'm going to upgrade all the things here. Shield damage upgrade. Do that. 
Let's see what else we can get here. We can get a laser, short range laser cannon, good defense against enemy fighters. Yeah, that might be that might be nice. So we'll do that. And what was the shield boost? 350. Okay, we don't have enough for that. Okay, fine. We'll do that. And we'll move onward here because we're we're near we're near where we need to be for the one mission, I'd say. This guy's got some big, big mother humper down there, and then we've got we gotta get over to here, which is gonna be gonna be the rough parts. Uh, let's wait for a second here and see if this guy starts to come for us. Oh no, there's more moving that way. Okay, now there's like three in that sector. That's not good. And now they're coming up here. All right, it's fine. Let's see where is the. Hostile ship at there he is. There's two of them here. Yeah, we're not. I don't think we're gonna survive this one, honestly. But like, I'm pretty sure we're not going to survive this one. Oh yeah, oh, oh, that broadside. That broadside, yeah, that's that's awesome. Yeah, we're not. There is no hope for us, my friends. There is no hope for us here. Even with my repair droids doing the best the best work they can do, that uh, that broadside there is not going to work. Oh, we managed to destroy that guy though. Just got that guy destroyed. This guy might not be too much of a problem. These these fighters though are going to be an issue. Come on, come on, destroy him, please. All these fighters focused on me. That would be very nice. And alright, took him out. Took these fighters out now. Stay focused on me, fighters. Stay focused on me. Don't go after my escort. Nice. Very nice. Alright, we managed to pull that one out of the out of the jaws of defeat. All right, and there is something out in space there. What is that? Wanderer Bolter. Sure, I'll I'll take that. Why not? <laughs> I've got I've got the space. Might as well take it. All right. Well, I think that's been a good look at at uh, Battle Stations Harbinger it is for iOS and Android devices. I believe it is four bucks on those respective stores. It's a nice little roguelike, um, you know, kind of in the, in, the, in the frame of FTL and things like that. Um, and uh, it's by Bug Bites. And I will have links in the description to all these things. Thanks so much for watching everybody. And I will see you next time.